Hello lovely YouTube family, what's up? Welcome back to Roblox Swim. So guys, in today's video, we're going to discuss the new Kingdom Hearts games in Roblox. Are you guys excited? Let's get started. So keep up with me till the end, comment right below this video, subscribe if you still haven't, and turn on the post notification for more videos. Number 1. Kingdom Hearts X Kingdom Hearts X is a mobile game that takes place after the ancient Keyblade War. Players can create their own Keyblade wielder and join one of five unions. Many of the chapters in the game are set in Disney worlds visited by the main series in the past. It's a mobile game, so it's definitely not the best Kingdom Hearts story experience. I would say you shouldn't play this one at all unless you've at least played through the main three titles in the series. The game is complicated and adds new story stuff spread through hundreds of chapters, making the lore even more confusing to follow. Number 2. Kingdom Hearts Recoded Kingdom Hearts Recoded debuted at E3 in 2010 for the Nintendo DS. Most fans dislike the game because the story has no bearing on the main games. Unlike the other games that are interconnected and weave a tale of Sora's travels through many Disney kingdoms, Recoded just doesn't matter. In the grand scheme of things, new gamers who have never played a Kingdom Hearts game before can definitely skip this one. Nothing of note happens in the story that makes the excruciating gameplay worth experiencing. Every world featured in the game is just copied from earlier Kingdom Hearts games that are worth experiencing. Other Kingdom Hearts games tell a better story, with better gameplay mechanics, and this one is completely skippable. Number 3. Kingdom Hearts 358 Over 2 Days Kingdom Hearts 358 Over 2 Days is another portable title in the Kingdom Hearts series that is pretty skippable. It was also released on Nintendo DS in 2009 and introduced a new protagonist called Roxas. Roxas is the new nobody that was created after Sora, transformed into Heartless during the first game. Roxas also features briefly in Kingdom Hearts 2, and the story is the best aspect of this game. It details the time Roxas spent in Organization 8 and the time spent with Shion and Axel. The actual gameplay of Kingdom Hearts 358 over 2 days is where this game falls apart. Square Enix included all the cutscenes from it in the recent Kingdom Hearts 1.5 remix, so you don't even have to play it to know the story. It's utterly skippable if you have the remix version ready to play. Number 4. Kingdom Hearts – Chain of Memories Chain of Memories is a sequel to the first game that debuted on Game Boy Advance. It feels like a watered-down Kingdom Hearts experience, down to the card-based combat that feels drastically different. While there is some strategy involved in making the most of the card system, the worlds included in Chains of Memories feel tiny compared to the first game. The story takes a backseat to the new card-based combat, making this a less compelling entry in the series. Number 5. Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance Dream Drop Distance released on the 3DS, but Square Enix did an HD remake for PS4 that was included in 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue. The game is the best portable Kingdom Hearts game on the list so far. The story is enjoyable if stilted, especially with the introduction of time travel in the game. The time traveling aspect only serves to make the story more confusing at points, but it's still enjoyable if you pay attention. The game has you play through each world twice, once with Zora and once with Riku. It keeps things interesting while exploring, and it shows Riku has grown as a character. What makes this game stand out against other mobile games is the gameplay. The command deck system from Birth by Sleep returns for this game, but it's not as well implemented as Birth by Sleep. So guys, this was all about today's video. Share as much as you can. That really motivates us to create more content for you guys. With this, we end our video. I hope you liked it. Do hit the like button down there, comment down your views, and do share with more of your friends. Take care, see ya!